Oh, and making news now, people in one Taney County neighborhood tell us they're banding together to care for dozens of cats and kittens living in a dilapidated house after the animals were abandoned by their owners. Color 10's Crystal Blair is live reporting on this story in Branson tonight where the residents say they have reached out to the county, but they can't seem to get any help. Crystal, what'd you find out? Well, David, in addition to these abandoned cats, we were also told that there were a couple of dogs that were left in the home behind. However, when the county stepped in, the owners did come back to get the dogs. But when it comes to the abandoned cats, they tell us the rules are different. The people of this small rural neighborhood in Taney County say these cats were left behind when the owners had to vacate the premises. You shouldn't abandon your animals. Sometimes circumstances take it, takes it out of your control, you know, and maybe that's what it is. I don't know. Thank God for these neighbors that help feed them and take care of them and are advocating for them or they would just lay here and die. Amanda LaRock says she reached out to Animal Control but was told that there was nothing that could be done about abandoned cats. She shared how this made her feel. Mad. Sad. Real sad. When I go home, um, I stand outside and I cry. But now I, I see a light at the end of the tunnel, and thank God. Her neighbor Terry helps feed them and even built a shelter. Dogs or any other four legged, two legged, 14 legged, whatever it is, any other animal, there's Normans for, but Taney doesn't have. You know, anything for cats. Some of the cats are very tame, while others not so much. But for resident Helen, they're all hard to resist. I've got 13 or 14. Oh, Terry, stop, <laughs> stop. I've got uh, several cats at home, and part of them are her, were hers. And I've got a four, I don't know, 14 or 15 cats. And I can't take any more. I can't. I can't. Thank you. And God bless you. Thank you for coming out here and helping us advocate for these cats. Now, I did reach out to Taney County Animal Control, and they told me that they will take the cats when the owners voluntarily surrender them. In the meantime, the people in this neighborhood are just hoping that others will step up to adopt these animals and give them a loving forever home. Reporting live in Branson, Crystal Blair, Ozarks First. All right, Crystal, thanks for the update there. Not a medical coverage.